Welcome Bonus Army to another video. Uh, this is a video that won't be focused on gaming, but it is a precursor to a new series I will be starting. Anyway, uh, as you guys know, uh, I do a variety of games, including uh, one of my favorites, Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon. Um, I'm going to be starting a new, um, a new series on Pokemon, Pokemon Sienna, critically acclaimed Pokemon ROM hack. And I've decided that, you know, um, do the whole, uh, since I'm gonna be doing a series, why not have you guys play along with me? So, I've decided to have a little, a simple tutorial guide for downloading Pokemon Sienna and playing it on an emulator so you can play along with me, you know, have your own magical Pokemon adventures. So, let's get started. So, first, what you're gonna need to do is get uh, Pokemon Sienna yourself, um, the IPS file. Uh, you can easily look it up on Google. Um, and it, you just gotta Google search it, find the IPS file, and also you need to get yourself um, a copy of the ROM uh, Pokemon Fire Red because that's needed to. You're going to. What happens? The way the ROM, the way the um, the game works, you have to patch an existing version of Pokemon. So you're going to need to download your Pokemon Fire Red and your Pokemon Sienna. So now that after you've done all that, you're going to also want to download this program Lunar Lunar IPS. It's a file that will let you patch um, your Pokemon Fire Red so you can experience a magical Pokemon adventure. So let's get our Pokemon Sienna. So you're going to want to transfer the IPS file. Uh, you're going to want to transfer the IPS file and a copy of your Pokemon Fire Red GBA file into one folder alongside the Lunar IPS. After that, you're going to want to quickly double click and click Apply IPS Patch on Pokemon Sienna Beta and Pokemon Fire Red GBA successfully patched. Um, and that's really all there is to it. Even though it still says Fire Red, this is technically Pokemon Sienna. So let's rename that Pokemon Sienna. I cannot spell today. Pokemon Sienna GBA. So after you have your GBA file, you're going to want to have an emulator. I personally use uh, Visual Boy Advance, but I've heard that it doesn't uh, exactly work on Mac. So, so for you Mac users out there, you might you might need to find a different emulator. Uh, there's plenty out there, and I'm sure there's one that can accommodate you. But anyway, uh, I'm not sure how that emulator works, but this is personally the one I used. I used it for Apollo Ultraviolet. It's a pretty damn good emulator. So we're going to so you're going to want to open your hack. And yeah, voila, you have your Pokemon Sienna. Anyway guys, um, yeah, anyway, I'll be looking forward to the series and playing Pokemon Sienna version along with you guys. I strongly encourage you guys to download and play this uh, Pokemon uh, ROM hack on your own as well. So, you know, we can play around, have magical Pokemon adventures as you watch me play it as well. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope it was helpful. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and um, I look forward to doing the po this new Pokemon series alongside you guys, my viewers. Anyway guys, if you um, enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Uh, a like, comment, subscribe, whatever, to help um, support the soon-to-be-coming series. And I hope this was helpful. Anyway, this is the Veteran Pendragon, signing out. See you guys. Bye.